Okay, we have successfully defeated Dusk Gutter, the beast we see laying right there. Amiri wanted to do this on her own, and she did so, of course, with a little help from her friends. It is time to return to Olex trading post, I believe. He wanted this beast to get dealt with as well as Amiri did. This was sort of a personal triumph for Amiri. She's probably happy about that. All according to plan. So, back to Olex. Yep, there. They are already waiting for our triumph. I need to catch my breath. Yes, return, where she is already getting tired. I think we all are a bit tired after that fight, so let's have a small rest. Let's see, uh, let's manage actually, because you there and you can do the healing. Not that we really need that, but it's good to have in there. I don't expect a lot of trouble here. Begin resting! So here's what we got so far. Today, Amiri killed 10 kobolds, a troll, a ho dog, and more goblins in the fingers on two hands can count. You know, I don't think our readers are going to believe all this. But it's the truth! I can cut them all down easy. We just need to find them. Well, that didn't go too well. That means that we have to buy those resources anyway. We were allowed to rest, no one attacked us overnight. Pokart Hunting Grounds, that is somewhere we need to visit at some point and Fanberry Cave and Random Encounter. Hello there. Hmm. No mistake. Let's try this. They'll never see me coming. Who are you and where are you? Cobalt? Cobalt. You this go there. Do it. I will deal with this guy. Enemy approaching. Charge! Okay. That was a good strategy. Stuff. And you have... Oh, let's just take all of this. We have space. I think we should have quite a lot of space right now. And yes, we do. Excellent. Now let's try to get back to Olex without any extra interruptions because yeah, these two are in a bad shape. I need to catch my breath. Of course you do. Okay, back at Olex place. He should be happy to hear that we in have accomplished time. this mission. And then we are going to deal with your mission pocket. A fine day to you. What brings you by? Tuskater is dead. You could mount his head on the wall as a trophy while we keep the bacon. That's one heck of a beast. I'd love to have a trophy like that, but a deal is a deal. The head goes to old Benson and his bounty goes to you. Master Brock Longbow, we'll speak another time. Farewell. And I'll level up. I think that is level 3. Yes, let's do the quick save there. Level 3. And let's just deal with everyone. Okay, let's take the level. Rogue, we shall continue on Rogue Path. We will get Evasion, which allows us. But if a character makes a successful reflex saving throw against an attack that normally deals half damage on a successful save, he instead takes no damage. A helpless character does not gain the benefit of evasion. And rogue talent, this is good, we need those. Athletics, mobility, trickery, stealth, perception, persuasion and one extra for trickery. 
So next, we are now... We have now capped these for this level. So next level, I can start taking either Knowledge Word or use Magic Device. Both are good. I have to decide that, but not right now. And then we will take Feet Alduri Dueling Mastery. Which grants us a better reaction on battle start. And most importantly, you gain plus two shield bonus to your armor class. If I am only single dueling sword in one hand. Wielding only a single dueling sword in one hand. And that is what we'll do. Rogue Talent. It's going to be Iron Guts. Plus one on all saves against poison, as well as plus four bonus on saves against all spells and effects that cause the character to be nauseated or sickened. That is what we will take on this level, most definitely. Next, and we are done. With Sabir, we have more. Oh, you haven't been... You'll take a wizard. We need your spells, ability, trickery, stealth, knowledge, arcana. Ooh, we do need these as well. Ah, not right now. These are the most important one for her. Accomplished sneak attacker. She needs that. I could have used that as well, but I really needed the AC bonus. She's gonna take accomplished sneak attacker, I believe. Oh. Sh no, actually, she is going to take a precise shot. You can shoot or throw ranged weapons at an opponent engaging in melee without taking the standard minus 4 penalty on your attack roll, which they always suffer if they are uh, shooting, firing, casting ray spell or something into melee combat. So, yes, this is going to be her next. And this is going to be hard, actually. What do you need? You have these, okay. Grease is good, we always want grease. Uh, the next one is going to be a bit of a problem. Reduced person could be helpful. Ear piercing scream could be very helpful. Fair. First, all of these are actually quite helpful. Through strike. Well, these are wizard spells, so she can learn more. Take reduce person. That's it. Excellent. Next character is Lindsay. Of course, it is. Bard. Just persistent Bard. She is great as she is. Level 5, and your points are really bad. Use magic device, persuasion, perception. Knowledge world, and this is a problem. Knowledge arcana, well, we already have a companion with that skill. She could use some stealth, actually. She doesn't need trickery at all. But if I'm going to take knowledge arcana, it is going to max her talent right now, and that is what we are going to... No, of course it's not going to max her talents. How many points did she get? Uh, five. One, two, three, four. Hmm. Oh, mobility. I want her to have three points there as well. Yeah, three points there as well. Lingering performance, point black shot. I like spellcaster. I think it's going to be lingering performance. Or point panic shot, both are cute. It's going to be dodge. Dodge bonuses, they stack. So even plus one dodge bonus to her, it's useful. And we need her rather alive than dead. So it's going to be, next probably is going to be lingering performance and then we are going to go with the point black and shot. And things like this, right now we need her to be alive and supportive. 
she doesn't need the heat that often. And here we have... Oh, this is a cute... Hideous laughter, of course. This spell affects the subject with uncontrollable laughter. It collapses in the gales of manic laughter, falling prone. The subject can take no action while laughing, but is not considered helpless. After the spell ends, it can act normally. On the creature's next turn, it may attempt a new saving throw to end the effect. Uh, these are a bit conditional, but this is one of the spells that can actually last through the whole game, so we will have that. Yeah, it's the best spell that she can learn right now. Inspire competence. A part of the third level of higher can use this performance to help allies succeed at a task. They get plus two competence bonus on all skill checks as long as they continue to hear the part's performance. This bonus increased by one for every four levels the part has attained beyond third. Excellent. And then our friend Amiri, of course, Barbarian. For now, at least. Same thing, uh, you need actually perception as well. Mobility is important to you, lore nature, persuasion, and perception. And I think that is. That might be the last mobility, I'm not sure. Oh, let's do it like. Actually, no, let's. Perception first. She doesn't really need persuasion right now. And this is a problem. Blind find Dart Dutch. We need to keep her alive as well. She has a really, really bad armor class, so everything she can take is a good one. X oh. Oh, danger sense. A third level barbarian gets plus one bonus on reflex saves to avoid traps and a plus one dodge bonus to AC against attacks by traps. Good. Good. Who else? Valerie. Fighter level three. Let's just keep you going. Uh, mobility and perception. Yep. Perception and persuasion are pretty much the only talents you are going to skills you are going to use after this one. Mobility three because she needs that. She's always fighting defensively. This is a harder one. Nah, not really. Heavy armor focus. Right. That grants grants her plus one increase on armor flaws when using heavy armor, and let's be honest, that is the only thing she uses. The armor penalty is reduced by 3 and the maximum dexterity bonus allowed by his fortress shield increases by 2. This is good. And armor training, this is important one, because she can now use more dexterity if she gets any to support her armor training, armor class. And Harim, should we just take... Yes, let's just take all of them. Lore, religion and perception. You don't need, really need anything else. Uh, this is going to be a bit of a problem. Iron will would be good. All of these would be good. Shield focus, shield caster. Do you have combat casting? No, you don't. Now you do. We need that for a cleric. And then you, Regonar. Magos. Persuasion, use magic device and athletics. You already know those. So why not? Oh, this is going to be interesting. Oh, oh, yes, he has a good 
charisma. Let's take arcane accuracy and uh, weapon focus. He was using scimitar, I believe. Yes. That is now dealt with. See the true track, shocking grasp. Ray on a. This could be very useful, actually. He is using his sword to deliver this. You'll take that. And that is that. Oh! And now, Sabir has grown far. Excellent. It suits you. A pokken. Yes, we will deal with your quest very soon. So let's see. Composite longbow. Uh, my strength bonus is sort of bad. So let's take master wood. Master work instead. Composite longbow. Composite longbow, and now you can use this. Right, we can sell it. Oh, you already have magic weapon. Uh, I don't. Can't be helped. Those will get sold. The armor, accessories, sword rings, and other. Uh, offer masterwork non magical and all this. Deal with it. And we need, of course, we need gap in supplies. Let's take. We have three of those and we need six per rest. Let's take nine. Those are just really, really heavy. That is what bothers me. Hello, Lindsay. We need to rest. Oh, we also need to set some spells, actually. I'll do that really soon. Book there. We will read those at some point. We need all of this. You, we do not need. And then spellbook. Your spells owe you already. Yes, you did have one domain slot. Restoration, not even a question. That away. You, uh, you don't need that. Take another restoration. Actually, until we know what we face, just take more restorations. And that is protection from evil. Let's clear these ones as well. Shield of Faith. Oh, oh yeah, you can't use actually. Well, that is a good one. And I think you can use this. Yes, you can. So why not? And he can also. Hmm. He can also cast spells from these healing spells. He can use these as healing spells. So let's give you bless as well. One minute per level. And let's give you. Will negate rather not. Summon monster one. It's extra. Yeah, summon monster 2 is also extra. True. You. Okay, Octavia. You need at least one mage armor, and from other spells, you need magic missile and. Uh... Hmm. This is just for her, right? Personal. Let's take one and lost person and uh, automatic missile. 
And that's it then. Everyone should be healed. And they are. Yes, they are. We will have to be chatty chatty with these guys soon, but we have spent quite a lot of time dealing with stuff, so let's go and deal with Pokken stuff first. I mean right now, so that he can rest easily as well. I have some junk, but it's not a long way. Leave, accept. He wanted us to... What is there? Oh, talk to Jihad about our... Well, I will do that when we return. Fan... Oh! Fight. Fanberry game. Let us strike as one! Two, victory. Why am I running there like that? Why are you there? Ooh, go away! Nope, nope, you use that one. You will remain using it. Ha! Oh. No matter what your goddess says, you are going to use those. Great set weapons, not melee weapons. We need him alive. Endless Plains. Hmm? This expanse could be perfect place for a farm when someone deals with the Manticore that's claimed the plains for its hunting grounds. Let's see about the Manticore. Let's see if we're up to this task, actually. Okay then. Let's see about All this manticore. Maybe we I'll should rely on stealth, though. We don't know what we are facing here. Where are you? Okay. Yeah, are we up to this? Why? Oh, you will take the bow. Oh now, let's try to deal with this thing. Lindsay, perform, inspire, and now let's deal with this guy. And now you can run in. Feel free to do. Whoa. Well, that was easier than expected. And we even managed to skin it. That was actually... <laughs> well, easier than I had feared. Manticore, right? A belt. What sort of belt? Belt of incredible dexterity to... That will be useful. Anything else? Loot and spells. Octavia will read those when she has time. Nothing here. Oh, more loot. Oh, someone was naughty. And we haven't inspected. Whoa, band of grease. Magical scimitar. This looks better. In due time. So what horrible monster lurks here? Just one manticore. Oh. You don't need to be in stealth far. anymore, Lindsay. Hey! We got what we came for, and we didn't even know what we came for. No doubt, where is that belt? Belt of incredible dexterity plus two. Thank you. We need to raise your dexterity as well. 
you have constitution belt that is good and you were using scimitar so let's give you magical scimitar almost all of you have magical weapons now all of except me of course as it should be so now i believe we actually had something to do here In due time. Let's rely on stealth. Tears. We are not hunting. Repent. No, no, no! Don't we will prevail. Too late. We'll attack them. This oh, this is For what I, I wanted. Well, at least skin them. Thank you, and we have me. I didn't mean to do that. Poor dears. All according to plan. No, it wasn't according to plan, Savir. Monitor lizard. This yes, will be right. according to plan. Enemy approaching. Yeah. Hey, Amiri. You have a good friend. Ah! Excellent. Skin them or don't. A mirror check failed. I didn't even check if there was a trap. Follow my lead. That was pretty careless of Sabir. In due time. So we are just here to get those berries, right? An ambush, eh? Can you, you make an epic my spiders? You need inspiration. Good thing that I have that rogue talent that reduces the chances for me getting poisoned. Well, not does not reduce my chance of getting poisoned, but increases my saving throws. I believe really about the same thing. So where are those berries? That is gold. not far. Is that cobalt? It's a cobalt. Those of mage armor. Let's be more careful. As it oh yeah. Be. Sneaky, sneaky. Let us strike as one. For Gorum? Yep, I knew there was going to be more of you. Hopefully, not too many. Come on, a little help, please. Thank you. Okay, that was stupid of me. Uh, I ah, straight damage, of course. Two the affliction. Simple play. Yeah. How bad? Two points. All according to plan. That was a bit cocky from Sapphire. These are the fine berries. That was easy. Excellent. So what is there? What kind of gear do we actually have right now? So we got fangberries. That is what we came for. And pose of mage armor. Their sight betrays them. Hold on, enemy swarms. Some small sized enemies such as rats, spiders, or mango. Mango. Huh? What is that? 
Mandragoras can gather into swarms and act as a single entity. Such enemies can be extremely dangerous. They cannot be defeated with simple weapons. However, they are vulnerable to acid and alchemical fires, spells with an area effects, or spells that require an attack roll such as acid splash. As a last resort, you can also try to use torches. Didn't I just see one alchemist fire? And that is our only one, and your ranged attacks, you only have as its plus. Yep. We shall return later. She needs to have something like burning hands. I believe. At its blast does so little damage, so whatever swarm there is, we're not going to deal with it. We will return. Right? It's not the It's not wrong to retreat when you know that we can't actually win that one. Well I don't know, but I have a sneaking suspicion that we are not going to succeed. And once again, we are back. In due time. About those tasks of yours. Hitfang berries. Are these the berries you were looking for? Ah, fang berries. So fresh. You've been good to an old man. Thank you. Here, take these potions. If you need more, feel free to return. I'll even give you a discount. Potion of restoration, lesser potion of cure light wounds, item lost, fangberries. What do you use these fangberries for? Truth to be told, as I've gotten older, I've gotten kind of particular, and my appetite is almost gone. Everything I eat is practically tasteless to me now. I can barely force myself to swallow a bite. Only thing I can still taste is fangberries, so I add them to my porridge or to roasted meat. I even add it to my potions. When I ran out of fangberries, I stopped eating entirely, so Atlanta tried to help me. The deer, she baked pies for me, cooked me fish soup and stewed venison, but I just couldn't eat any of it. I was desperate. Those damn spiders had sucked the last bit of joy out of my life. If not for you, I'd pretty much have starved to death, miserable to the end. I should go. A fun day to you. What brings you by so me your wares? Upper. Normal scimitar. There's nothing. Here with these, no, all of this is marked as junk. Junk it is. And we didn't rest or anything, and I forgot. I didn't heal my wounds. I should have. He could have done that. Nope. How may I serve you? I found the temple of the elk and killed the beast there. Erast you be praised, you finally returned, my good friend. Christian told me how you helped him at the temple of the elk. Thank you for heeding my request. My heart is calm and filled with confidence that I've followed the will of my god. I would like to reward your bravery. I possess no treasure, but please take this as a token of appreciation. Scroll of Remove Blindless, Axe 2. Thank you. As far as I know, your next target looks to be the Stag Lord himself. With the Temple of the Elk cleansed of evil, the fog surrounding us should disperse to reveal the path to the Brute's lair. Of course, magic so powerful is unlikely to disappear all at once. Bide your time. Follow up on other concerns while you wait. I will gladly aid you on your noble quest. Arastil himself foresaw our meeting. 
Do you understand the true meaning of your visions now? I trust in their truth. These visions, they were the voice of a Rastil himself. Quiet, but clear. Before all this happened, I believed Arastil had turned his back to me. But now, I see clearly. He has shown me divine mercy, for he has led me to you and invited me to aid in a fellow priest's deliverance. Lady Serenray and Arastil walk the paths of the gods hand in hand, and so must their servants as well. Tristian is undoubtedly still very young, and youth is a time of naivete and confusion. But I see kindness and strength of spirit in him, traits indispensable to a priest. I sense that all that's transpired thus far is only the beginning, and the future promises great things for Tristian and for you. This is why Arastil led me to the Temple of the Elk. Day and night I pray for you and for my young friend. May the stag god lead you down the true path. As you wish. Yeah. Good talk. Right then. 